Metra's fleet in the 1980s mostly consisted of worn-out E units, modern F-40s, random switchers, powerful F-40Cs, and a pair of F units. These two F-7s were the only ones that operate under the Metra brand. Much like their E unit counterparts, these two F-7s would originally start their life on the Chicago Northwestern. Both units were built in 1949 by Electro Mode Division and were originally numbered 4082 and 4083 respectively. They were primarily used on the railroad's top link 400 trains and eventually commuter trains. The F-7s would be relegated to the road's commuter service well into the 1980s and into the days of the Regional Transportation Authority. By 1984, with more powerful and modern units arriving onto the RTA, the two F-7s would be renumbered to 305 and 308 and repainted into a lighter RTA blue and eventually put to use on the work trains. And by the early 1990s, they would be repainted again into the iconic Metro livery we all know and love. Despite their status as work units, they did see occasional use on excursion trains, as in 1993, they'd be put to use on NRHS excursions around the Chicago area. In 1999, Metro would donate both F7s to the Illinois Railway Museum in Union, Illinois, to which they both would continue operating into a new millennium. Upon arriving at the IRM, 305 would be renumbered back to 411 and painted back into its CNW colors, while 308 would keep its Metro colors even into today. Both units see occasional service on the museum's trains today, but they can be seen in their prime during the museum's events, like the infamous Diesel Days event, to which sometimes they would both be paired up on the same train, alongside other F and E units. From backbone passenger diesels, to a commuter agency's janitors, from excursion showgirls, to museum pieces. It seems like an eventful life, with a very happy ending to these iconic Chicago work girls. But they're not the only pair of CNW locomotives out there.